Hard to argue with Vanover's win, but behind him, Carnage once again. Carnage has really been a theme on this course. Watch Alex FPV's drone here in red and blue. He taps Nub's drone and ends up going down into the stands. Disco drone of Vanover out in front, followed by the blue drone of Heads Up. They are one and two. Oh! Heads Up went flying off. We'll see if he's out or if he recovered. This course is so difficult. Watch Sky right there making contact with Amari going down. The white drone of Amari and Sky tangle. Somehow Amari seems to stay in the air there. Then watch Heads Up's drone. Him and Vanover in the disco drone actually collide. Vanover perfectly fine in that scenario. Heads Up is lights out. Be in front when the music stops. They're through gate number oh, one and already Flexi is gone. Heads up in blue, in first, and actually Soren is gone as well. This will be a solo flight for Heads Up. Normal he drops through the cloud gate, That's now into the T-Mobile right. tunnel. Uh -oh. Oh, no. Heads Up is down. <laughs> He still will advance because he made it the farthest. I wasn't going to let off. <laughs> Jordan, not the sudden death we expected. Not at all. We had a hard launch from all three of these pilots, and look at how close they are going through that first gate. Fluxy, he got a little aggressive, smacking the inside of the gate and crashing out. Then Soren also had some trouble there. He just barely taps that railing, and it looks like he must have lost an antenna and was done. Once heads up, crossed the next checkpoint, he had officially won sudden death. So he decided to have some fun, and he does a barrel roll right there, and then he comes in the T-Mobile tunnel at full throttle and ends up crashing out. <laughs> Embrace the possibilities as they go through gate number one. Heads up in blue, the disco drone of Vanover. They're first and second. Oh, no! And look at that. Heads up again. Makes a mistake. Takes himself out. He'll go to his first ever sudden death. Jordan, as a pilot, mid-airs have to be oh so frustrating. It absolutely is. Look at the beautiful launch by both Vanover and the Disco Drone and heads up in the Blue Drone. Now, they're both so close together. Watch them come into this East Gate. They end up both just running into each other, taking each other out. Both of them flip around a pre-turn, too close together, end up going down. Here's a beautiful look at it right there. But once a drone hits metal objects, it's very difficult <laughs> to keep flying. Who wants to be the boss of Beale Street? They're all through gate number one, heading over to the east gate. You've got the disco drone of Vanover in first, but heads up with a great turn. He's right there in blue, and he oh, goes no. down. Heads up is out. The disco drone of Vanover, closely followed by Nub in purple. Oh, no. and Nub and Vanover make contact. That leaves Alex, the red and blue drone, clearly in front. The Golden Heat Jordan, as you know from your career, is always interesting. It definitely is. Watch heads up in the blue drone and Fanny in the disco drone. They actually tap a little bit, which sends heads up into the ground. Keep a close eye on those two. Fanny just gets right in front of heads up and forces heads up into the ground, taking heads up out. And then watch. Here's the purple drone, actually gives Vanny a taste of his own medicine, taking Vanny out of the race. Nub does a wonderful job staying in the air. That leaves Alex and Nub as the only pilots up. Alex holds on to the lead all the way to the finish, giving him the level six win.